I wanted to take a moment to show my support for anyone in the world who has peacefully protested for their freedom of choice, including those who have joined the Freedom Convoy of Canada for this purpose. Unfortunately, the mainstream media have painted a very biased and one-sided picture of what the main message of these protesters have been all along. Freedom of choice. Wanting to stand and fight for having free will has nothing to do with politics, your level of education, or racism, but it's about human rights. Personally, I have taken three doses of the vaccine. Not that anyone needs to know, but it was my personal choice. I have a doctor's degree. Not that people's level of education makes them any more intelligent than anyone else. I am from an ethnic group and I don't have any extreme political view one way or another. But I fully support anyone who's fighting for the freedom of choice, especially in a peaceful way. And I personally don't support any extreme mandates such as lockdowns, general mandatory masking, especially for children, and being forced to be vaccinated. COVID has brought a lot of grief and hardship to us globally. And although just like everything else, nothing is ever black or white, and there have been a lot of factors to consider in terms of what to do during this pandemic, many of us agree that these extreme mandates have caused a lot more harm than good to the society as a whole than the virus alone. And science and politics should have never been intertwined in this way. So after two years, we really need to take a look at the big picture, stop pointing fingers and concentrate on the present time and realize that COVID is here to stay. So should we continue to live in fear and have our choices taken away from us? Or should we start living our normal lives, have the freedom of choice, and stand up for what we believe is the right thing to do? Thank you for watching.